so guys by all means you know I am not a DIY queen but I am resourceful enough to know when I can't afford something and how to figure out how to make it now I watched several DIY videos on how to make a camera stabilizer on YouTube I've watched film right frugal filmmaker Andy Mogul and a couple of others I will list them in the description below um, but I did find a stabilizer that I liked that I wanted to make it's quick simple and easy it's not as complicated as the one that I found on film right though I will eventually attempt to make that one no I did not make that one this time but I will show you how I made this stabilizer which was inspired by frugal filmmaker the link to that video will be in the the link to that video will be in the description below but right now I'm going to take that apart and step by step show you how I made it um, now one of the steps that he did is completely different than what I did so let's get into it the machine screw is going to go in. Taking an elbow, place that in the back of the That part is going to be 
elbow joints and attach them to the top of the TV shirt. And there you go. There's your wrist. So you got your screw hole. Now that I have my stabilizer built, I'm about to take it on a test run to show you how well it works. Let's go see. Okay, you just saw the test shots from my stabilizer. Um, as you can see in the shots without it, it's a little bit shaky, a little bit janky. You, yeah, not quite usable. Um, but with the stabilizer, it was a little bit better, a little bit smoother. You can go into Premiere and use Warp Stabilizer to kind of smooth that out just a little bit more. Um, but yeah. That was my DIY build for my stabilizer rig. Um, if you would like to check out the video that I got the idea from, click in the links in the description below. It will also be on this little eye right here. Um, if you would like to check out any of the filmmaker channels that I um, subscribe to and watch on a regular basis to help me out during my film school journey and during this journey of becoming a filmmaker please check out the links in the description below um, but that's pretty much all that I got for you right now come back for another DIY come back for a film review tell me what films you want me to review man I can't spend my money to go to movie theater to see a movie to review for you if you don't tell me what movie you want me to review it's just that simple. Just, what are you doing? Why are you not giving me suggestions? Um, click down below for my social medias, my Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram. Remember, all of those things. Click down below also for my Patreon page. And donate just a little bit of your time and your little money, you know, you know, you know. To help out with the channel that will be awesome and amazing. Um, also check out the link in the description for the gear that I use, not the ones that I built, but the ones that I use that I actually bought off Amazon. And you will be helping me out greatly if you buy something from there because I am an Amazon affiliate. Um, also check out TubeBuddies to improve your YouTube channel and your YouTube experience. I'm also an affiliate there. So, I love you guys. You guys are wonderful. You guys are beautiful. Go out keep making films, watch my stuff, support me, support the channel, support all independent filmmakers because we all will one day be Steven Spielberg and Francis Ford Coppola and Sofia Coppola and all of them. So be kind, be brave, be awesome, go out, create. Love you. Mwah. Bye guys. We are the music makers and we are the dreamers of dreams. Mm -hmm.